Before the song Then Leave came out, there was a moment, and we interviewed you during this moment, mm -hmm. when it was the cucumbers and it was the green hair. At that moment, did people recognize you Definitely. with the music? Definitely. That, that was the beginning of it. Okay. That cucumber thing, it really branded my likeness. People knew what I looked like, the green hair. When I get booked for shows, people was like, I, I remember in Atlanta in 2018, I was a cucumber nigga, that's what they called me. I say, you, you the cucumber nigga, you know what I'm saying? When I met Key Glock about two years ago, what's up, man, you the cucumber nigga? I'm like, I guess I'll take that, I'm the cucumber nigga, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, uh, people who know me, you know what I'm saying, they know I'm just, I was going through a phase and it was, I was making a lot of money off that disgusting Justin era, that whole cucumber thing, it was a time to be alive. If you was at a Beat King show, it was crazy, you know what I'm saying, so, yeah. Did the green hair, was the green hair, that color selected to match the green cucumbers? Yeah. Was that the purpose? It was, it was that, it was, um, I had a video shoot in Oklahoma and my homegirl Bree, we still cool to this day. It was just a lot of nasty stuff going on in this video shoot in Dallas, man. And she was just like, man, you're disgusting. I'm going to name you Disgusting Justin. I was just like, you know, it had a little ring to it. So when she said that, I was like, well, cucumbers are green. I'll dye my hair green. It matches the green throw up emojis with Disgusting Justin. It was like, I just invented a whole lame ass comic book character. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The whole Disgusting Justin thing. But yeah. Why did the green hair stop? It stopped, man, because I looked, I went in the restroom one day and I looked in the mirror and I was like, you're 34. Cut that shit off. You made a lot of money from it. It was funny. It was dope. But cut that shit off. You know, so now I'm 35. I'm going to be 36 in what, two months. I can't be walking around with green hair. Nobody going to take me serious in a fucking meeting. You know what I'm saying? But it was fun, though. I don't regret it. It was a crazy time. How long did you have that green hair for, rough I estimate? I had it for a year and a half. And prior to you making the decision to switch up the green hair, mm -hmm. did people say, okay, enough of the green hair, hey, tired of the green hair, we don't need the green hair anymore? Nobody ever said it. Okay. Nobody, my daughters would tell me they were tired of it. But other than that, it became a part of my brand. People associated that with me, you know. So I saw a lot of other people doing it, getting green hair. And I was just like, I'm just a trendsetter, man. It's been that way. And I never get credit for the things I start. But I've started a lot of stuff in hip hop, straight up. Like if B-King didn't exist, a lot of things in hip hop would be different.